Yeah. There's blood on the back of this. What do you want to do with it? I'll just throw it in the pile. I'll give it a wash. Yeah. Look, I've got to get to school, but are you right to clean the rest of that up? Uh, yeah, no worries. Sweet. Hey, yeah. Uh, you did a good job. Thanks a lot. And I'm sorry about before. It's OK. As long as everything's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just, uh, you know, business is slow, that's all. So yeah. See ya. if you've got some time to talk about this shark attack. Charlie's got my statement. I don't know what else I can tell you. We have some information about some other attacks. It would help if you could confirm a few things for us. Do you mind if I... Yeah, I do, actually. OK. <sighs> Must have been a pretty big shark to leave you with, what, 30 stitches? Same bigger. So you can confirm that it was a tiger shark? If that's what I said in my statement. Well, do you think you might remember how long it was? Tip to tail, uh, can't remember. So the shark that almost killed you, you don't know what type it was or you don't know how big it was. Do you know anything about the shark? Um, it had a lot of teeth. Look, I don't know where this attitude's coming from, but the sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of your hair. Unless there is something you don't want me to know about. What's that supposed to mean? Well, you tell me. You're the one evading my questions. I'm just a cop trying to do my job and protect the community. You waltz back into town after killing my cousin. You torment his father and harass his widow and you expect me to answer all your questions just because you're a cop? Your hotshot lawyer must be right. You are crazy. So you're not going to answer any of my questions? I'm not going to even answer that one. Well, of course, I could compel you to talk to me. For example, I could impound your boat until you decide to cooperate. I feel that you're impeding an investigation. I might feel I have no other choice. I'll be at the station if you decide you want to talk. that lawyer you got her to smarten things up a bit? Well, she's trying to, but she doesn't set the trial date. Plus, she has a backlog of cases. I don't know, Alf. I'm really worried about Irene. I honestly don't know how much more she can take of this. Anyway, sorry for talking so much. Thanks for listening, though. I really appreciate it. That's what I'm here for, love. All right, we'll see you later. Mate, have you seen my bookings diary? No, why? What's the problem? I might have to cancel a few bookings. That clown Angelo's threatened to impound my boat. What on earth for? He wanted a few more details about the shark attack and I might have wound him up a bit, so he started throwing his weight around. Uh, did you talk to Charlie? Yeah, I'm heading over there in a bit, but I thought I might just cool down. Yeah, good idea, mate. You're not thinking about living at the farm full time, are you, love? No, I just want a few more pieces of furniture in the house, so next time I go and stay, it's more comfy. Uh, fair enough. Well, I'll give you a hand to shift. Just sing out when you're ready. Thanks. I was going to ask Hugo, but he's been in such a weird mood lately. He'd probably bite my head off. Sorry. Hey, it was a visit with Irene. It's pretty terrible. She's doing it tough. Well, mate, for what it's worth, Kirsty said that you and Annie made Irene's day. Thanks, Mr. Stewart. Excuse me. Irene shouldn't be in there. Angelo knew it was an accident, and he locked her up anyway. Martha, she shot someone. You know, if it wasn't Angelo who arrested her, it would have been someone else. Yeah, but someone else would have let her out on bail. She shot a copper. She was never going to get out on bail. They should have never let him come back to the bay in the first place. I tried to be strong for her. As soon as I stepped in that place, I just wanted to run. I felt like a coward. You're not a coward. You went, and that's the main thing. This must be really tough on everyone. 
You know, the whole time I was in there, all I could think about was seeing you. Just pretending none of this was happening. Irene will get out. I know she will. Isn't it at times like this that you pray? Well, isn't it important that right now you dig deep into your hope and faith? If prayer can move mountains, surely it can help a good woman like Irene. Shops open if you're buying. Smokes, grass, tabs. Whatever a pig shooter wants. It's a pig shooter. We shot a cop, right? It was an accident. Always is. And you're off your boyfriend, so you're a black widow as well. You don't watch yourself. You're going to become a legend around here. Don't worry. Half the chicks in here are doing time for often their better halves. So, what's your poison? Don't know. I'm good, thing. thanks very much. How about some booze? Believe me, you can take the edge off of this place. And um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm good, thanks. You know where I am? 